I'm going to clean up a pair of Florsheim Imperial tassel loafers. But these are made of elusive shell cordovan. Oh, by the way, uh, these I purchased for $3.20. So I'm going to basically just clean them up um, and then try to find them a good home. Uh, but this from the guys that I trust that have multiple pairs of shell cordovan shoes for decades. Um, I'm using this because of their recommendation. And this is Lexol Meets Foot Leather Dressing, dr leather dressing Non-Darkening. We want to make sure to really nourish these very well. The key with shell cordovan is this and this. Just to brush them, brush, 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 okay? All right, so let's get started on these. Well, they're very runny. So here we go. That already looks better compared to that side. Take a look. Obviously, brushed, not brushed. Now remember, there is not one drop of shoe polish on these things yet. You start to understand the allure of Shell Cordovan. Um, what I'm gonna do next is a little bit of a mirror shine just on the toe area. Now let me show you this one. This one, took probably two minutes and it's the first time I've done it so I did it off camera and uh, I'm, I'm going to show you the exact procedure that Andy Vaughn, owner of Pure Polish, recommended to me. Uh, but this is the Pure Polish High Shine Paste Wax. So he says just a few swipes. Now this stuff to uh, kind of, you have to let your body heat a little bit. See just a few swipes. You can see a little bit of dye on my finger. That's from the, you know, that's fixing that strap. Now, do you see the fogging there? Okay. So it's just a few swipes. And you go the other way. I'm using no water, using no rag, just, just that stuff on my finger. Just a couple minutes. Pretty awesome, huh? This is a simple shine. This is edge dressing.
and here they are all finished up. You really do need to get Shell Cordovan in good lighting there to really appreciate it. And I didn't do anything additional to this toe cap other than what you saw me do. Right? And again, other than just the tips of the toes there, there's no polish on these things. Just Lexol, Neat's foot, right you saw the bottle. Isn't it gorgeous? It's the natural beauty of Shell Cordovan. Brush it, brush it, brush it. Brush it until you feel like your shoulders are about to fall off. It's the heyday. Florsheim Shoe Company. It's a beautiful logo. It's nice when they're not worn off. And look at the stitch density, by the way. I didn't, I didn't uh, you know, point this out before. Stitch density is much higher than, you know, even current Allen Edwards shoes. Thank you everybody so much for watching. And if you've ever been caught by a friend or coworker checking out another dude, checking out if their shoes are good, you're welted, that is, you might want to consider subscribing to my channel. All right, God bless you guys, everybody. Have a great day, and I'll see you later.